see me and thank you for coming. So, please come forward. We're going to move forward closer to the building. Do you have another copy of the lineup? Like then when we get closer, we're going to charge! No. Say this, and I've got to have my brother Dr. Clay say something. Trayvon Martin is not the disease. His case was just a symptom. And if you miss that, you miss the point. Because if it was all about Trayvon Martin, this would be over right now. Trayvon Martin is dead. Emmett Till is dead. In this city, Rodney Abernathy, dead. And many other people across this country, dead. What are you gonna do to help the living? Dr. Clinton? So now I would like to introduce Mr. Jason Gardner. Um, he will be acting as MC for uh, our rally. So, Mr. Gardner. What's up? How y'all doing? Hey, hey, hey! What do we want? Justice. What do we want it?
say you got junk thread along here. How many of you guys around here have a beard or dress? Keep this white for anything. Your ass is going to get kicked. Sorry. Okay. Uh, you know, I found a long time ago if I wanted to have somebody stop and listen to me that I had to look sane and I had to talk sane. You are the future police chiefs who would have arrested George Zimmerman. You are the future lawyers who can analyze the stand your ground law and wipe it out of existence. You are the future professors who can teach the history of race, class, gender in this country and put it in context. That's on you. Understand where you are. Understand who you are. Understand where this country is and understand that you better be damn well ready to make it something different. Yeah. Alexander Trayvon Martin, a 17-year-old man killed to death for being quote unquote suspicious. 17, on a rainy evening, a black male in a hoodie that just came from the store with some snacks, walking down the street to go back to his dad's house with his hood over his head Probably because it was raining. And a name and a guy named Zimmerman. Dog Martin, the kid, was suspicious of him. Decided to call the cops on the hooded Martin. The guy followed Martin down the street. Talking while talking to 911. They told the man to stop following Martin. He refused and decided to confront the kid. Arguing started with the kid. Don't do, but I know I had to for this. I would love for every black male in here to make their way up front as we do this. Right? 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 Police have brutalized Trayvon's dignity and his family from the moment they arrived on the scene, saw a black boy, and made a presumption about the value of his life. Yeah! Who could have easily been Trayvon? Our uncle to 11 young black men who could easily be Trayvon. And I myself, and all of us up here could have easily been Trayvon at any day, right? So, for us to make change, and one of my boys told me when they knew I was coming to do this speak was, it's good to do this rally, but if we don't work to make change happen, then we did this all in vain, right? That's not what we're